Hello, what is up gaming lovers everywhere, it's Vice Grip Gaming here, and I'm here to bring you a very exciting new video on the Xbox One S FIFA 17 bundle. Now, I got a new Xbox basically because my last one fucked up, the hard drive uh, has gone bust, I don't know why, I think it, well, I do have a little bit of an inclination, I think it's because it overheated too much, which in turn ruined it, but that's a different story. We're here today to talk about the Xbox One S FIFA 17 bundle, which is, I've been waiting for for a long time, so I'm, I'm happy that it's finally, you know, got here. Um, it's 40% smaller than the standard Xbox One, which is, you know, good, everyone likes to, to have a new thing, it needs to be adapted, it needs to be changed for it to be accepted really, I mean, look at the iPhones and things like that, but basically, okay, so it's 40% it's smaller, I still went with the 500 gigabyte one, which is all I really need, you know, there's only so many games you can play all at the same time, which... You, you know, if you're playing any more than that, then you might as well delete one. So I've got this. I've got enough space for 500 gig. I don't need any more than that. Um, it it can come with a, ver a vertical stand, but I'm not going to bother buying that. It, you know, laying down, stood up. There's not really much of a difference. So that's nothing really for me. And you'll see that in a minute. It does advertise the uh, brand new stand for it. Um, so here, obviously, you've got a few games on the front, which are actually really the Gears of War one. I cannot wait for that. I'm absolutely buzzing for the Gears of War 4 to come out, which I'm also going to do a video on that for you. Um, today, we have got the new Xbox One S controller as well. It's a new white controller, which is really nice. I'm, I, I prefer it to the black ones, uh, just because it's you know a bit cleaner, a bit sleeker, and it, it's just a bit different to your standard. Xbox one so here you've got a few diagrams explaining how to set it up um, if you've never had an Xbox before it's that is literally it. everything else is explained to you on the Xbox if you have had one before that's pretty irrelevant you know it's your box standard stuff um, okay so the next box I'm about to take out which is that one just in the middle there uh, comes with a 14 day Xbox live gold trial so you know, if you've never had Xbox Live before, this is the chance where you can test it out. There's the advert for the vertical stand. Pretty irrelevant, if you ask me. But, yeah, if you've never had Xbox Live before, it's a great idea to, you know, use that trial to see what it's all about. Um, the new Xbox One controller, which you're about to see in a minute, has an increased Bluetooth con connectivity range, which... Again, to be honest, it's a new feature, but it's a pretty desperate feature because, I mean, how far away do people really sit from their TV? So, yeah, okay, it's increased in range, it's a lot further, but what good does it really do? Uh, there you saw the 4K HDMI cable. Now, I say 4K because it looks like it's been adapted uh, to... to it, it does look a lot different to the old one, so maybe that's because it's going to be 4K ready. I'm not really TV tech smart, but... There's the controller I was talking about, I think it's really nice, uh, the triggers seem to be a little bit harder, a bit more responsive, so that's always a good thing in my eyes, you know, you get uh, more of a feel of if you're playing a shooter game or racing game, just makes it, you know, a bit easier. Uh, the next bit is, now this is my favourite, well, <laughs> sadly one of my favourite features, is the fact you don't have a power pack anymore, it's integrated into the Xbox One S, you just have this cable which you plug in, makes it a lot less uh, cluttered, no, not too many big chunky crappy wires laying around all over the place, so well done Xbox, that's a good, good change. Um, the, I'm actually quite excited to try out the FIFA 17, because I'm not really a football guy, I don't really watch football or take it and then interest into it, so I'm going to do some funny videos, you know, check them out, I'm going to get my missus to be playing as well, you know, so we're going to see what we make of that. Um, here's obviously the FIFA 17 code and the EA access because you get I think it was a month's EA access with this one or three months So I've never had EA access. So I'm gonna try that out See what new games come on. So again, not really a sporty game, but games like Mirror's Edge I love I've been playing Mirror's Edge recently great great game uh, really happy with that um, so yeah, it's 4K ready, which is good if you have a 4K TV, it's not so good if you don't have a 4K TV. So here's the Xbox One S. Uh, the front buttons are actually not touchscreen anymore. You've got the disc tray button and the power on button, which I like a hell of a lot more because I didn't really like the touchscreens. I didn't feel really feel like I was pressing anything. 
Uh, one amazing thing that I did not know until the other day is the Kinect has gone. There is no more Kinect for Xbox One. They clearly realised nobody bothered with it, nobody really cared about it. So if you've got Xbox uh, Kinect games and you love them, then really think hard before you know you look at buying this new Xbox One S. Um, another new feature on the front that you'll see in a minute is there's a new IR blaster enabling you to command your TV using the Xbox One media remote if any of you want to get that. So all in all the Xbox One S has a lot of great new features. I'm very happy with it regardless of you know my TV or anything that I can't particularly use. Um, so I'm really happy to be able to share this with you guys. It's nice and sleek, it's small. I, you know, it makes everything look a lot better. If you're a collector like me, or if you want to be a collector, then this is pretty much a must-have. I absolutely adore it. Um, very happy. So, yeah, thanks for watching. You know, check out my new videos that are coming up. Gears of War is coming up very soon. I'm going to be smashing that, getting loads and loads of videos up. Absolutely love it. Thank you very much for watching today. You know, like, comment, and subscribe. Help me get myself out there. Take care of yourselves, and speak to you soon.